So Anastasia has uh, the new format of Facebook business pages that I don't even have yet because sometimes they take years, two to three years to roll out a, a new uh, feature. And this case, this is the case here. So Anastasia, you're trying to find the list of your followers because now instead of fans, they call them followers and they've integrated, they've, they've basically brought together the whole of you fans slash likers to followers. They've integrated those numbers so that you just have one number now and you have some followers that might be spam followers you know that might be uh, bots or spammers and you're trying to figure out how to remove them so uh i am you know i don't have access to this new format so so we're going to play along here and see if we can figure it out so first of all can you click on 1.2k followers and see what shows up so you are able to see um at least some of the some of the yeah so you are able to see your followers right oh no you can't it's no. unavailable oh <laughs> uh, that's not know. that's not very helpful is it um uh, switch profile ah okay so this is very helpful that we just saw you do this because i wouldn't have thought to do this on this new format so okay now you can see followers okay so now next to the follow so um Next to the followers, can you click on the three dots? We're not going to remove anybody, but click on so you can you can block report or block. Yeah, um, no um, report. So here's here's what I'm not totally sure of. If you block someone, I'm not sure if you're blocking them from following your page or if you're blocking them as personal Anastasia, because um, and because. I just tried blocking a spammer from my one of my reviews. And when I blocked them, even though it was I'm working on my business page, it actually blocked them as George Cow personal profile. So uh, I'm not sure about that, but you can try blocking and and see if um, if you block enough people, whether your numbers change 1.2K down to 1.1K at some point. Sorry about that. Does that, does that make sense? So, so that's that's one that's one possibility. The other possibility, the other the, the, the in the old format, we used to go to the edit page or the page settings. If you click on the three dots on the top right, or not top right, just on the right side next to page edit page, yeah. Oh, yeah. I'm sorry. One more thing. Sorry, sorry. Um, click away here. Uh, there's three dots next to search. Can you try that? manage blocking okay so that's interesting okay. um click on that and see uh oh i'm sorry i don't want to reveal who you blocked so I, I apologize for that but you you can you can technically type a name um if there's a specific person you want to block you can type a name and click block um oh click block followers on the right side and try oh, this everyone no, I don't think so. No, <laughs> no, no, it's not blocking everybody. I think it's blocking specific people. Does it? Ah, it doesn't do anything. It doesn't click at all. Okay. All right. Well, um, okay. So you could see here that um, we are still in your business page. Oh, it's... oh, and now it's up. Okay. Now it's up. Okay. So it took, it took like 30 seconds for, the, for it to come yeah. up. So now you should be able to click the checkboxes next to certain people and click block. I guess okay. So try but, try one. Do you, is there one that you absolutely think might be a spammer? Uh, I I blocked everyone that I felt like they were spammers. Oh okay. Already. So I don't have someone. Uh, my well, my initial intention was to re remove likes that were like family members and people that don't resonate right. with my yeah. messaging. Yeah. Now, just so you know, when you block someone, they can't. Uh, actually, can you click cancel on this or click X, X out this, this pop-up window? Um, yeah, just click on the X on the top right. Yeah, oh. there it is. Okay, so you can see here, it says, once you block someone, that person can no longer see things you post on your timeline, tag your page, invite your page, or start a conversation with your page. Okay, so um, I believe that what this means is they cannot find your page anymore. So they are no longer one of your followers yeah so there you go 
I hope so. I basically I think I gave you two ways to block. I mean, one way is coming here, and then the other way is here with the clicking of the three dots. I think those are the same thing. And if you want to test it out, you can block someone from this dialogue and then go into the other dialogue and see if they've been uh, they're listing as one of the blocked users. Yeah. So yeah, I, I was hoping to find a way to not have to block them, but I guess there's no way anymore. Right. Right. Yeah, there's um, oops, I, I just interesting. Uh, yeah, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. You, you said you were finding a way to to what? To I was trying to find a way for the friends and family. I, did, I was find, trying to find a way to just remove them from the likes. Not to block them, but to, to remove them, them from likes. Yeah. yeah. Um, I guess. I wonder how it's going to be shown on my Facebook feed if I share something from my business page, and they are blocked. They won't see. even show up. They won't show the post. They won't see the post at all. Okay. It's like it never appeared. It's like it never existed for them. So, okay. Yeah. Okay. Thank you. You're welcome. And thanks. Um, Julia had posted a help article um, that, uh, yeah, in, 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 the, um, in the chat. And I'll put the help article below. So I thank you, Julia, for that. Um, apparently, there were instructions there <laughs> and I, did, I didn't, I didn't, I, didn't I just, them. I just assume, you know, I guess when it comes to Facebook, I just kind of play around. I don't even read instructions. I just kind of play around <laughs> and usually it works. <laughs> yeah. So great. Thank, Thank you. you.